Hello, my name is Ray Michelina with the TJ Snow Company here in Chattanooga, Tennessee. What we're going to do is just a uh, look at a normal startup on a resistance welder today. We're going to look at what we need to do before we get ready to operate our welder in a production environment. And we're going to take a look at the normal startup procedures on a fairly simple welder. You want to refer to your own company's uh, requirements as far as doing a startup for your own specific needs. This is just looking at the different systems and some simple things you need to look at and perform before you actually put your machine in production. So first of all, we want to make sure that our air pressure is on and we're ready to weld with the set air pressure that we're supposed to have. We're going to come down and make sure that we do have water in our system. We have water flowing through all of our visual sight gauges on our welder. Now we're going to take a look at our well control. We've got our well control here. It is off. Before we turn it back on, we want to make sure that our electrodes are uh, in place and seated. Make sure all of our water hoses are connected. We don't have any air or water leaks on our welder. And at this point, we're ready to go ahead and turn on the power to our welder. So what we're going to do, because this is a disconnect, we're going to stand away from the door opening. We're going to face away when we go ahead and turn on the power. So we're going to turn on the power. We're going to watch as our weld control comes up, goes through its uh, initiation, make sure that our weld control is up. We're going to go to the other side and we're going to look to make sure that everything is still set for us to weld. We're going to look at our digital water flow meter, make sure that it is up and reading the correct water flow for our welder that we have set. So at this point, let's go ahead and run the welder through a couple uh, dry runs just to make sure that the welder is working before we go to do our weld. <clears throat> So what I'm doing is making sure that we have operation of the uh, electrodes coming down. <clears throat> they are making contact. We don't have any water leaks, air leaks of any kind, and we are ready for normal operation. So at this point, we would go ahead and turn our weld control into weld, and we would begin our production run. We thank you for being with us as we went through the different systems and the different practices uh, in order to get this machine ready to do a normal startup, say for a shift uh, startup. Uh, if you have any questions, be sure to contact us here at tjsnow.com. We'll be glad to give you any advice, offer any questions you may have.